Like most homes, child care centers use a large amount of hot water each day. Gunderson Lutheran's child care center is no exception. The dishwasher is often running to sterilize dishes, bottles, utensils, and toys, and the staff does six to eight loads of laundry a day. To cut down on energy costs, Gunderson Lutheran is now using renewable energy sources to heat the water used at its child care center. And the th solar thermal is solar hot water, and it will provide approximately 85 percent of the, the solar water needs for the child care center, which closely mimics a residential application. Here's how it works. Black solar panels were installed on the roof of the child care center. A special glycol water mix runs through coils in the panels and the sun heats up the fluid. That fluid then passes through a heat exchanger, which heats up the cold incoming water from the city. Then the hot water is ready to use in the building. If the solar heated water isn't quite hot enough, a traditional hot water heater activates and heats the water further before it's sent to dishwashers, washing machines, sinks, etc. Uh, a typical system would cost about $10,000 and in the uh, environment we have right now with the tax incentives and the rebates that are out there, you can uh, expect about a five-year payback. According to Corey Zarecki and Tom Thompson, solar hot water heaters have practical uses for residential homes too. We did it to help educate our staff and the community about renewable energy options in Wisconsin. We did that at this at the child care center because traditional hot water heating is one of the largest energy consumers in a, in a residential home. After five or six years, you end up with um, free, clean energy from the sun. It's a tremendous opportunity for us to spread the word and really make a difference in the community. So even though this is a small piece for Gunderson Lutheran, if you magnify that by 100 or 1,000 or 10,000 people, I mean, we can have a significant impact on, on our energy needs. And there is a unique side effect to the solar hot water heater installation, a side effect for the kids. And there's another type of payback, which is perhaps more important, is, is our opportunity to, to teach kids early on uh, how important it is to try to do these rene renewable energy projects and to teach them about solar and how it works. The solar hot water heater project is just one piece of Gunderson Lutheran's plan to lower energy costs and lead the healthcare industry in environmental stewardship. The health system's goal is to become 100% energy independent by the year 2014. By the end of 2009, Gunderson Lutheran improved energy efficiency by 25% using low-cost or no-cost retro-commissioning efforts and plans to offset the remaining energy needs with renewable energy. For more information on Gunderson Lutheran's environmental stewardship program, go to gundluth.org backslash green.